Lucas Media. So Angel Reese did her press conference last night. And of course she was emotional. I ended up seeing it as well on Undisputed this morning. A couple things I want to highlight. As y'all can see the other young lady in the image, Gabby Marshall. I think it's ironic. And even Sports Center <laughs> uh, showed this online. She waved goodbye to Angel Reese. But when Angel Reese did it to the Kentucky player, she was considered classless and it's all type of names, right? And I just wanted to call out the hypocrisy with that. Also, Angel has said that she hasn't been happy since she won a national title. And everybody has been, she's been getting death threats. And uh, even her teammates were sticking up for her. I'm, uh, Flage was sticking up for her and saying that y'all don't, y'all don't know her. And she even acknowledged that their issues that they had this year. Y'all remember when the moms was going back and forth? But they said that she has a really big heart and she's a caring person. And she just said she's been through so lot, a lot. Paul Pierce and Keyshawn was both saying that they they get what she's saying, but this is what comes with it. You know, you're in this, the. When you become one of the most well-known people, yeah, it's cool. You get all the the glitz and the glamour and. You walk in concerts, did everybody know your name? Yeah, but then the backside is you're going to get a lot of hate. A lot of people, they're going to try to dig up information on you. A lot of people are going to nitpick for whatever reason. And, you know, honestly, they're going to hold Angel Reese to a different standard than they hold a Gabby Marshall or a Caitlin Clark. All of this happened last year when Angel did the, and I'm going to give his, him his credit, the Tony Ayo. And then he point, you know, where you she waved her hand between her face. But Caitlyn did it as well with the Louisville team. So Angel did it back to her and pointed her ring. And from there, everybody, you seen all the people coming out saying, oh, she's classless. Look at her. And that. But when Gabby do it or Caitlyn Clark do it or even a Tom Brady, oh, they're such competitors. Look at them. And it got so bad to where. The first lady of the United States thought about wanting to invite the Iowa to the White House as well. Now, this has never happened before. Also, if it would have if Rose would have been reversed, they would have never even thought they would have never even brought that up. But no, I mean, Angel has to understand this is her first year. She'll get used to it. You gonna get a lot of hate. Um, actually, they said something that I agree with. When you are famous like that online. You can't really look at the comments. I get it. You want to see all the praise, but you're going to get so much hate. And we're designed that if a thousand people say something good and one person say something bad, you know, it, it bothers us. Well, I'll say this. It don't bother me because I don't care if you're saying something good or bad, you're talking about me. But I can see how that can affect people who aren't prepared for it. Also, I'm a whole lot older than Angel Reese. So I'm, I'm I already know what's coming with this. But she'll be okay. I really think that last night was her last game at LSU. Um, unless it's a financial reason, I don't see another reason for her to stay. She was already, what, most outstanding player last year. Already won a national title. What else you got to prove? But for her to say she hasn't been happy, I think that she just, she doesn't realize she's not the same Angel Reese anymore. And you got to adjust to that. This is like Michael Jordan. Michael Jordan ain't been the same since he really he hit that shot in college, but I'm a stamp when he played his rookie year in the league. He ain't been the same ever since. And it's not the fact that he's not happy. You just got to move different. And I think Angel will have to do that, too. And even when she gets to the WNBA, it's going to be an uphill battle because now all those professional players are going to be trying to try her and Caitlin Clark. You know, so they got to She got an uphill battle, but, you know, she'll be OK. You just got to get used to it. That's all. But I want to get my quick thoughts about it. You know, the whole Angel Reese thing and the double standards that if she do something, she hate it on. But a Caitlin Clark can do it. And she's such a competitor. Even though I'm a fan of Caitlin Clark, she was balling last night. But I'm just sick and tired of this double standard stuff. But I want to get my quick thoughts about it. What y'all think?